and Mark Fuhrer will run the show for us. Okay. Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, Jalil. Thanks for joining us today. No problem. No problem at all. Cool. Um, I'll wait and see who wants to start us off with questions. Uh, looks like Andrew Jones is going to go first. So go ahead, Andrew. Okay. Hey, Jalil. I uh, appreciate you taking the time to talk to us here for a few minutes. Um, one of the things a lot of people are talking about this team is the defensive line and replacing what you guys lost a year ago. But when it comes up, Mac, Coach Bateman, Coach Cross say that the way you progressed late last year gives them a lot of confidence moving forward that, that you guys are going to be able to, to handle your responsibilities. Can you take us back to the last few games of last year and just kind of illustrate how you did uh, progress? Um, to be honest, with me, I feel like the way that I um, was brought into a couple of the games at the beginning of the year, and and just 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 being just being present in a few of those different situations, um, getting the game speed down pat, I feel like that helped me a lot. And of course, messing up a little bit and getting fussed that helped me a lot also. So I feel like that put me in a good position. And then once me and Ray start getting th thrown in there together, I feel like we just start. We're talking more now. We're hanging out more. Um, I just feel like we connect to each other better now, which, which, which has helped us a lot, and it's helping the young guys too. What one or two things have you noticed early on? I know you haven't had full contact yet, but have you noticed early on that you're definitely better at than you were when last season ended? Um, that I'm definitely better at? I don't like thinking of it that way, but I would definitely say, I would definitely say leading the group. I mean, of course, we had we, we're a young group, and we had um, we had two big dogs leave us last year. So with, with them gone, we needed somebody to step up. So I feel like that leadership trait is really important with the young group that we have. But on the field wise, I think I'm just I'm just a smarter player now. I get I get the defense better, which helps me a lot. Because when you when you get the things that you're doing, you you play faster. So I think that helps me a lot as well. Cool. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, over to you, Ross. Hey, hey, Jaleel. Um, you, you mentioned Raymond Bohasic. How are y'all playing off each other? And he said he's playing nose. What spot are you playing at? Because I know you're all both kind of interior linemen. Mm, to be honest, that's what I like to call it. We're, I like to say we're both defensive tackles because we have plays where he'll bump over to the three technique, I'll bump down to the one technique. So really, it depends on what players are called. So basically, I'm going to stay to the boundary every play. He's going to stay to the um, field. But you never know, depending on the offense, we could be traded. So it's, it's basic. I like to say we don't even have a nose, but I like to say we got two defensive tackles because uh, we're both, we're both, we're trying to get more versatile and learn more positions so we can move back and forth more and, and, and have that better connection. And, and then what are you seeing out of some of the younger guys? I know Tamari had a pretty good year last year, and, and a guy like Christian Varner or Kevin Hester. What can you tell us about those three guys? Um, Tamari is is one of the smartest dudes I know. Like, even me being being the leader of the group, help trying to be the leader of the group, I have to turn to Tamari sometimes and say, hey, Tamari, I got a, I got a brain freeze. What, what we got right here? So Tamari is kind of the brains. Like, he, he's so smart on, the, on and off the field, and I think that helps him a lot. And, and Christian Varner, he's – I think he has progressed the most. When we came out here and started – I didn't even recognize who he was. He this whole offseason, you could tell he's had his head down. He's been working. He's a hard worker. He's been way stronger, and, and his pass rush moves are progressing. He looked just just 20 minutes ago, he was looking like a dog out there at practice just then. Um, him, KJ Hester, KJ Hester, he's he's a big kid. KJ, Hester, he can manhandle some people. So I really like KJ Hester. Him and Miles Murphy. Um. They're coming along pretty good. But as of now, Christian Bruno has really stepped up. And I feel like he's one of those guys that's progressed the most. Awesome. Thank you. No problem. Okay. Over to uh, Deanna King. Hey, uh, Jaleel. I just want your opinion uh, about playing for Coach Cross and, and what he's full of excitement. Is he the same way in practice, uh, getting you guys uh, – motivated to on the defensive line yeah yes yes ma'am um coach cross is the most genuine coach i would say that i've ever had um he's always full of energy he's gonna always be honest with you he's gonna always be up front he's gonna tell you the truth about every little situation but he brings he brings a lot of joy to the table he he, 
he's like he's a realistic coach. So um the energy you guys see on the um on all the videos and let's get this work, all those memes, it's really him. That's him hundred percent of the time. Um he's always gonna be gonna um bring bring energy and all that to the table, but he's also gonna be honest with you and tell you how it is and what needs to be done. You mentioned Miles Murphy. Uh, how, how are the younger guys doing? Him, uh, Clyde Kinder, some of the other younger guys. How are they adapting to the the college play? They're they're adapting. Actually, I just had a conversation with Coach Cross. I said those young guys are adapting to college way quicker than I did. I was like, should I be worried? They're they're, they're adapting way quicker. Um, Miles Murphy, he's a big kid. He's he's active. He loves to do spin moves and pass rush. Um, Clyde Pender is really excited to get in here and play. He's um he's a quick kid. He kind of reminds me of myself. Um, like I said, KJ Hester, big kid. They're powerful, and I see a lot. We we got a bright group, and I told Coach Cross they're moving a lot faster than we than I was moving when I was a freshman, and um, I like what I'm seeing. Thank you. No problem. Okay, uh, over to Gregory Hall. Jill, you mentioned should you be worried about how some of these younger guys are progressing. What is that competition, and how has that been like since you don't have Crawford and Strobridge that are kind of cemented as almost every snap guys? How is that competition going so far? The, the competition is great. and um, I feel like Coach Cross always says iron sharpens iron. So I feel like the better we all get, the harder I want to go. Me saying – me seeing Ray make a lot of plays, that makes me want to go harder. Me seeing Christian Warner tackle big kid, bull rushing somebody, knocking them over, that makes me want to go even harder. And I'm sure when I do something like that, that makes them want to go harder. So we see it as iron sharp and irons. We want the best of the best uh, players around us in order to make each other better. And with you playing kind of interior, who's playing on the edge? On the edge, we've, I've been seeing a lot of um, Tyrone Hopper, Tamar Fox, Desmond Evans, um, Tamari will bump to the edge a little bit. Young guy AJ Beatty has been getting some work in at um at edge a little bit. So we got we got a couple. Um by Senator Ray, he's been at the edge a little bit. So um we we have some guys that can play like Tamari Fox, he can play all three positions. Tackle, nose, edge. So we have a lot of um edge guys, but Tyrone Harper has been putting a lot of work in. He's looking really nice on the edge. Thank you. Okay, great. That's all the time we've got for uh, Jalil. We'll uh, we'll try to get you. I know there's a couple more questions, but Jalil, thanks so much for your time. We'll uh, we'll get. To